Right, okay, let's take this uh, 985 on a B, Land Rover 110 2.5 diesel soft top, ex uh, military, for a spin. I'm not going to take it out on the road because the MOT is expired, so that would be illegal. Uh, but I will take it down the um, take it down the farm track. Uh, it's just come into us in part exchange. Uh, is going to need some work on the chassis to get another MOT. Uh, as a minimum, it's going to need, I think, a new rear cross member and probably a pair of um, front outriggers. But uh, that is as a minimum, I think. Um, may well find other stuff as well. Um, but it drives nicely enough. Um, oil light ignition light come up properly. Starts nicely. It starts nicely whether it's hot or cold. It's the original 2.5D type engine in it. Showing 170,000 kilometres. It's been uh, out of military service since 2000. But um, so engine starts nicely. There's no hesitancy or overheating at all. Temperature gauge is sitting just above the, uh, just below the halfway point, just there. Um, clutch is nice. Gearbox is fine. The synchros on third gear are a bit um, worn if you rush it. If you sort of take it nice and slowly, fine. But if you rush it, you will get a, a bit of a graunch going into third. But it selects all the gears properly, fourth and fifth, one, two, three, four, and five, all no problem at all, and reverse. Um, the transmission overall, have we got any backlash in the transmission? Not really, no. In fact, no, there's next to no backlash in the transmission at all. Really quite good from that point of view. Possibly a very slight bit of backlash, but no more than that. Um, no uh, unpleasant bumping, squeaking, clunking, or groaning. Uh, from the suspension down this rough track, the windows are rattling a bit, but they always do on the military ones. Steering's nice actually, I've, uh, on our piece up there, I won't say where I've been with it today, but um, the steering actually steers nicely, it doesn't uh, wander about or anything, it um, goes exactly where it's placed. Steering wheel's about 20 degrees off centre, but that's normal. Through the big dip at the bottom, yeah, that's it. and it's absolutely fine doing that. Just turn around, but it stops nicely. You know, it's not a smoke L thing. It just needs say, a little bit of um, either welding or replacement of uh, a couple of chassis pieces, and you've got yourself, I think, a reasonably nice, um, nice ungot at military X military 110 because the panel work on it is nice and straight certainly. Steering is actually quite light for a non-power steered version. All the gauges work, speedo, fuel gauge and temperature gauge. Here to the left. There we go. Over the hook. Sit. Did the job perfectly over there. Really, I think there we have it. My name's Simon. You can reach me on 0771 906 9353 or in the office on 0118. 9463352 or you can go to our website which is www.motodrome.co.uk um, not going to take any part exchange on this one because it's going to be for auction only um, we can ship it anywhere you like in the world not under our normal terms though because we can't drive it uh, on the road so it will have to be transported at 90 pmr plus VAT in the UK we can ship it anywhere else you like in the world obviously uh, at a cost um, and we take um, debit cards and Visa and MasterCard, credit cards and debit cards uh, with a 2% surcharge for credit cards. Um, that's about it. End.